I'm Hayden Grove here with Zach Meisel, and Zach, the Indians' magic number is now down to three. So what are the three keys for this team to go far in the postseason? Well, it starts with uh, Jose Ramirez's helmet. He has to keep it on. No, I mean, it's 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 clear it's the starting rotation. Uh, they have Corey Kluber, Trevor Bauer, and then a bunch of question marks. And I think when he gets October, maybe Bauer's a question mark too. So uh, they, it's it's can they get some innings? You don't need seven, eight innings from Clevenger, Tomlin, or even Bauer. But can you get five? Can you get six? And, and just keep the team in the game so they can turn it over to the bullpen and let the offense come through. I think the number two key is definitely the bullpen. If the bullpen continues to do what they do and they get their innings well, I think they're going to be a big key for their success. And the third one is, is timely hitting. I mean, we've seen the, the Royals formula in the past has been just get four or five innings out of the starting rotation, let the bullpen carry you, and, and get those key hits in, in the right moments. The Indians have had a great knack for that this year with the way Jose Ramirez is hit with runners in scoring position. Coco Crisp leads the American League in, in hitting with runners on base. So uh, you need more of that. It's not something you can just snap your fingers and, and say it's going to happen. But uh, if they can get timely hitting, certainly that always helps. So the three keys, starting rotation, bullpen, and timely hitting. We'll see if the Indians can do it when they clinch the American League Central Division.